I had an existential question this morning that I woke up thinking. An existential question? What? And then he said, I don't even know if I said that right. Oh, okay. But I know the question you asked this morning about... It's like losing a friend. I feel like I'm going to lose a friend. <laughs> Tam is afraid that one day Niantic won't support Pokemon Go anymore. And then she won't have her game to play. Because they did that with the Harry Potter. But why did they do that with Harry Potter? Because it wasn't popular. Because people wasn't, weren't playing it. So there's no reason to support it. They'll only support something as long as it's making money. But so, all the... All the I'm, I've invested. Okay, there's one thing about me outgrowing it, and I get it. And yeah. That's fine. Yeah. But I think it's a more shock. It's a bigger shock when you like a game and it ends. It ends, yeah. And that's never happened to me. You're, you're, you're living the gamer life, baby. I don't know what to tell you. You're living the gamer life. Well, the game is no longer available. So I started asking you. Yeah. What are the games you like? Like, how long is. What am I. <laughs> Tell me so I understand when it's going to die. Like, it's what's not, the average there, there, the there is no average. It depends on its popularity. As long as it holds on to its popularity and it keeps enough that they're making money, they'll keep supporting the game. Wolfman says, afraid her game will be canceled? Nah, not a gamer. <laughs> I'm not a gamer because I don't know what it's like. Ha ha. But you're learning, and that's what part of being a gamer is about. I'm not like you where you had your heart broken when a game ended. Several times. Really? Several what times. One, what was the one that really hurt? That you thought, oh, why? Oh, why didn't they make another? And was it because you were too young to understand that this happens? No. I mean, it's it. Like, uh, i trying to think what was the last game. That you felt really sad and soft. I felt sad. Oh, uh, City of Heroes. That was the last game I was, that was like about, I want to say 12 years ago. It was a game I played a lot. I mean, we're talking I would play this game 15 hours a day, Tam. And I would play this game late into the night. I would get up at 4 o'clock in the morning to play this game with my friends. Right? I, I ran like three different guilds on this game. <laughs> you know? And uh, I had a website for them and everything. I played this game hard. And then Blizzard decided that they uh, were no longer going to support the game and that they were going to close it. And oh my god, I was just so upset. So upset. I mean, I, it's the first game I taught Rachel to play with me. Oh. She and I used to play it together. She'd be my little superhero sidekick running around, helping me defeat crime. 